and keep the ball below the waist. Third start this season for Connor, who has a 2-0 record in ERA at .90 through 10 combined innings of work. He struck out 13, only walked one, and as I mentioned, he pitched against the Red Raiders in the College World Series. You mentioned the changeup. Off speed there. Tyler Martin puts away Klein at first, and that's a one, two, three inning for Connor Grady and the Florida State defense. And making another start here on the season, it'll be his third with the 3.38 ERA so far through eight innings of work. Six strikeouts, five walks. His father Kevin played for the Red Sox and the Reds from nine. Four hits this weekend. And he's rung up for the strikeout look, and he took a step toward first, and he'll have to come back, grab the bat, and head to the dugout. Count. And so he earns a four-pitch walk from Becker. First base runner for either side is Robbie Martin as well in the top five. And now Elijah Cabell, surprise, surprise, wears another pitch. And down goes out. So a couple of base runners aboard for Florida State. A.J. Lestaglia, who's now at third base, had a good plate. This ball is lifted high and deep out to left, and Stillwell continues a hot weekend with a home run. Well struck ball, line drive, base hit. Masters turning for two. Lacey makes the throw in, it is cut off, and that is a double. You better cover the plate. Oh, got away from Nelson. A lot of big high bounce on that one. He's, he's handled, had a lot of balls in the dirt this weekend. Ground ball. Smith steps on the bag and the throw gets away from DeSatis. Another run comes in for Texas Tech. Grounder to second and Green puts away Carter at first. But two runs come in for Texas Tech. He's yet to record a hit against the Red Raiders, but he does earn a walk. Two out, one on. This is a chopper up the middle, and Green is thrown out at first. Nice play by Klein. Got one in a row this inning. And a four-pitch walk issued to the senior. Brown ball to first, and Carter Smith will step on the back. So Carter Grady able to navigate around those couple of walks. And he stares at a ball down and away, so multiple runners are aboard with one out to come in to the left fielder. At the knees, frozen with the fastball. Lifted high and deep, out to left field, out to the track, and Carter makes a terrific play out there at the wall. Took a couple more pitches, but he earns a walk after working ahead early. The ball is lifted out to the fence, and right, Lacey jumps up to make the play. He'll throw it back to first. Will he get it there in time? He did! Another breaking ball, and Jackson Green is rung up for the strikeout. Looking. Ground ball into no man's land. Velez tried to cover the ground, but did not get to the bag before Dylan Carter did. There. Ground ball. Smith steps on the back. This time, the throw to second does double off the Red Raiders. Appeared in 63 games last season for Texas Tech. Started all of those. He goes down swinging, and Velez shortens things up. He Around the baseball program, as Martin records the first hit for Florida State. People more interesting in the middle innings today is that one came up and in. And Matthew Nelson was clipped by that pitch. That is the second time he's been hit by a pitch today. Martin was named to the ACC All-Freshman team last season, and he goes down swinging with multiple runners aboard. That was in that situation. The ball is 
lifted high and deep to right. Has he done it? You bet! Got real quiet, Sean, when he hit that ball. Everybody was just marveling how far and how high it went to right field. Big curveball up in the zone. The bell knew he had it. He doesn't walk off many, but he. Albert chased the ball down in the dirt. Romback completes the throw down, two down. Ground ball here to second. Klein scoops it up and makes the toss to retire Carter Smith. But the. Well struck ball into right field off the bat of Klein. He pulls up at first. Lacey makes the throw into second to hold him there. Hit 290 last season for the Red Raiders. Showed bunt again. Didn't get it down. And he ends up striking out. Got him on three pitches. A breaker from Davis Hare eliminates the threat. And he walks for the third time. Texas Tech doubles them off. That ball is lifted high and deep, out to right, and Conley ties it. Out over the plate. There's a Conley. And down goes Baker. Play. the third strikeout now for Hare. And number eight is good for a strikeout for Sublet. Took another couple pitches, but Robbie Martin does earn his third walk today. That ball will get to the backstop. Martin will advance another 90. And down it goes. Sublet. Ball is lifted out into left field. Cabell giving chase. Could not make the play. That'll be extra bases now for Klein. He is turning for three. Now he pulls up as the throw makes its way in. Got away from Nelson. And Klein is now 90 feet away from scoring a go-ahead run. Lifted out into shallow center. Albert charges in. He'll make the throw. It is way offline. Texas Tech has the lead. A speed count here. The ball is lifted out into left field. Cabell on the run makes the play. Strikeout looking. Sublet goes fastball, 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 over, over, over. Kowski lost him. Base hit into right. Noisy with his first. And multiple runners in scoring position now for the Red Raiders. Still in home. Go! They can come look at this. Down he goes on a breaker and snagged in the bottom of the first. And this ball is lifted out into shallow left field. Carter comes on, he's underneath it, two down. One, two coming to the catcher. He's got him! And Texas Tech has gotten two wins here in Tallahassee against the top 15 Florida State team.